Hello and welcome to Low Budget Gaming and welcome to another quick updated graphics setting for PUBG. This one I'll cover how to get the blue blood and I'll show you a clip and we'll discuss the setting. So first and foremost, let me show you how to get the blue blood then I'll explain what it is if you don't know. So all you need to do is go into your library in your Steam, right click Player Unknowns Battlegrounds, go into Properties, Set Launch Options and type in Dash Korean Rating, KNR Capital. So that's it and press OK and this will enable the blue blood in the game. Now I'll show you some highlight from a game earlier today where I had the blue blood enabled so you can see the big difference between the standard red blood and the blue blood and why it is important that you have it on. If I can pause it at the right moment. You see how big a blue splat you get from this setting rather than the normal one and this is without a doubt a big disadvantage if you don't have this enabled so make sure you get this uh, set up so that you can see things better it's also useful for if you have like random gunfights in the distance you can tell them because of the color so back into the game let's quickly look at the settings again not much has changed from my previous settings but I have tried to play around with the uh, anti-aliasing so in the past I had suggested ultra settings and today I'm using medium I've tried high medium low and to be honest I haven't seen much of a difference if I went very low then it, I could tell that it was a bit blurry but up until medium it, it looks fine to me so based on what I know about anti-aliasing if you are playing on a lower resolution say 720p 1280 by 720 then you should have it higher if you're playing on a very high resolution say 1440p then you can reduce it quite a bit so even at low it would be fine so play around with this everything else is very low uh, textures we keep it at medium because if you put it at low it just looks like vomit basically so fx foliage view distance everything low v-sync motion blur off for the gameplay uh, you can select the crosshair color as cyan because again this is probably the one that is easiest to see color blind mode you can play around with this i'm trying out different settings to see if any of these work and so far i can't tell much of a difference so i'm trying different settings if nothing else i'll go back to the normal and yeah so this is just a quick look at my settings hopefully this is useful play around with it a bit and if you have any better suggestions do let me know as well and yeah thank you for watching hope this was useful